the level of the running back, for example, or the receivers, that they were just that much more difficult to bring down than you normally run up against? Was they? I mean, they they were good players. Don't get me wrong, but there was a couple key situations where I just felt like we didn't do everything we we could have. What happened on the play that Al you ran for the touchdown with the substitute running back, the backup? Looked like he was hit right at the line of scrimmage by a couple people. Um, Did I, I see it wrong? No, you saw it right. Just bad tackling. Just bad tackling. We had we had a great play call. Um, we just didn't execute the way we should have. What did the what, what did the week off do for you guys as a defensive unit? Um, it gave us a chance to rest our bodies. Uh, you know, it's a physical game, so we had a chance to get our legs back under us, uh, work on the tackling. That was one big thing we worked on this week, and really just get back to playing ball. Um, we had a chance to really scout Miami. And it's going to be a good game this weekend. You were two and one last year. What's the difference between two and one last year and two and one this year? Uh, the chance to be three and one this weekend. <laughs> <laughs> but what, what about the squad, the team, the, the feeling? I mean, it's a good feeling. I've said that from the beginning of the season. That this team has a unique feel to it. Uh, it's a closeness tied to this team that I really enjoy, and I feel like we're a band of brothers playing out there. Is it tighter this year than it was last year at this time? You know, uh, when you win games, it makes it a whole lot funner to play football. So that's one thing. What kind of uh, growth have you seen from the defense here in the, in the first uh, quarter of the season? A lot of young guys out there. Yeah, you know, uh, we have had a lot of young guys out there. Um, we play some good teams, so they've been forced to grow up. Um, you know, I'm, I'm proud of the way the guys handle clutch situations. Uh, you know, we had a couple couple red zone stops that really, really I thought we executed pretty well on. And that's something that maturity brings, and I'm excited to, to see the rest of the season.